Jesus, as we call him today, was teaching, and some Jews who were uh, part of the power structure of that day were, of course, resentful of this outsider trying to exert influence over the people and to speak his mind, to express himself, rather than towing the party line. And they said, by whose authority do you teach these things? What right do you have to speak your mind in our town, on our turf? Well, this guy Jesus was pretty shrewd. He knew that um, most of the people had confidence in this fellow called John the Baptist. And the religious rulers, the Jewish rulers, the powers that be, had to uh, carefully walk a precise course. They had to handle the issue carefully. Because if they attacked John the Baptist verbally, openly, in public, they knew that the majority of the people would, would rebel, would be hostile, because the majority of the people, the common people, had confidence in John the Baptist. And Jesus, of course, was associated with John the Baptist. They were members of the same party, so to speak. They were members of the party, quote unquote, that stood in opposition to the ruling power structure in place who claimed to own, own the situation. And this ruling power structure was saying, who gives you the authority to say anything? And he asked them, uh, the baptism of John, was it from heaven or was it of men? And these Jews couldn't say one way or the other without getting in trouble. So they answered, we, we don't know, we can't tell. At which point Jesus answered their original question and said, well then neither will I tell you by, by whose authority I do these things. The bottom line is, Jesus had as much right to speak his mind as those Jews. Everybody has as much right to speak their mind. Kings come and go. People of influence come and go. Customs come and go. Fashions come and go. Empires come and go. Who gives you the right to do anything? Who gives anybody any right to do anything? Many of the people in positions of power are not much smarter than you and I. They are as fallible and as flawed as we are. Who gives them the right to speak their mind? Who gives them the right to ascend to a position of influence? Who says you have to shut up? The crowd? Apparently so, it's the crowd. Public opinion. Which changes with the weather which is not infallible. If a gang of people embrace a bad theory called Marxism and decide to enforce that bad theory on the majority, you and I have as much right as anybody else to say no.